she's been a style icon since the 90s. And Jennifer Aniston demonstrated her sartorial skills once again while celebrating the new year with pals Jason Bateman and Jimmy Kimmel in the upscale enclave of Jackson Hole, Wyoming on Wednesday. The Friends actress, 49, bundled up in a fuzzy coat while shopping around town with her famous buddies. Jen flipped her hood up over and it had to keep out the chill, while completing her look with straight-legged black jeans, sturdy boots, and a pair of amber Garrett late sunglasses. At her side, a scruffy Jimmy Kimmel was seen donning a marmot jacket and a tan beanie. Jason Bateman remained out of sight. After a bit of adventuring, the group was spotted going to a liquor store to get party supplies before heading off. The star has been having a blast with her VIP group, according to E! News. The group all spent time together skiing during the day and hanging out at night, an insider said. Jen hit the ski slopes with Jason and some other friends and she held her own. She was having a lot of fun. The insider continued, saying, Jen seemed relaxed and in her element. She was with her closest friends and very happy. Aniston has been focusing on herself since her split with husband Justin Theroux in 2017. And while things eventually ran their course for the couple, Jennifer revealed she still thinks of the marriage as successful in January's issue of Elle magazine. She said the same of her union with ex Brad Pitt, who she was with from 1998 to 2005. I don't feel a void. I really don't, the Dumplin star said. My marriages, they've been very successful, in, my, personal opinion. And when they came to an end, it was a choice that was made because we chose to be happy, and sometimes happiness doesn't exist within that arrangement anymore. Sure, there were bumps, and not every moment felt fantastic, obviously, but at the end of it, this is our one life and I would not stay in a situation out of fear. Fear of being alone. Fear of not being able to survive. To stay in a marriage based on fear feels like you are doing your one life a disservice. When the work has been put in and it doesn't seem that there's an option of it working, that's okay. That's not a failure. We have these cliches around all of this that need to be reworked and retooled, you know? Because it's very narrow-minded thinking. 